Bitcoin mining can scale to any size. It can custom fit to any size of any, any energy asset. And it can be on whenever they want it to be on. They want it to be on 30% of the day. They want it to be on 40% of the day. They want it to buy that other 50 megawatts, but keep the other 50 megawatts selling it to the grid. That's, that's what Bitcoin mining can offer. Ultimately, Bitcoin mining will optimize clean energy, green energy, wind and solar, and eliminate, completely eliminate the problem of curtailment. Except for now there is because you can put Bitcoin mining anywhere in the world. It, people have yet to, I think, grasp the impact of being able to build demand anywhere in the world. Um, needless to say, you, you stop selling to the Bitcoin miner, the clean energy, you stop selling it to them and you sell it to the city now. And then you move the Bitcoin miner somewhere else to do more energy development. There's a great article, people should read it. It's, uh, it's called Bitcoin is a Pioneer Species. It was written before all of, before anybody even really knew the power of Bitcoin mining and what it could do. Uh, but it eloquently lays out by comparing it to nature, how Bitcoin mining can go in to places where there's energy poverty and eliminate energy poverty. Uh, it's an incredible article. Uh, it's a great, written by a smart guy named Brandon Quidham. I highly suggest people go read it. Mm. Are there a lot of people doing this? Um, or a lot of energy companies looking into this. Have you spoken to a lot of people or is this like, is this, is this like a very theoretical thing or is this something that's happening? Marathon just announced today that they're, they bought a wind farm. 